Now, another debate about animals in the city. That freak accident on Tuesday involving a tour bus and a horse-drawn carriage has prompted calls for bans. Some say it's the horses that have no place in the city. Others say tour buses should stay out of Chinatown. The city says it's willing to look at options. The CTV Stephanie Sherlock reports everybody agrees that something needs to change. Just really thankful that I'm alive because I didn't think I would be. The horse drawing her carriage allegedly struck by an oncoming tour bus at the corner of Fiskard and War. The horse got spooked. My sister and the driver got thrown off. Debbie held on for dear life as the horse bolted nearly a kilometer until she was finally able to jump off. This is obviously a liability for the city. It's, it's dangerous for people and it's especially dangerous for the horses being in this sort of environment. Animal activists say it's proof the horses don't belong. The of Animals doesn't believe that horses should be used at all, um, but uh, you know, in a city environment like this, it's especially dangerous for them, and, and really we need to speak up about it. Carriage industry supporters argue they do. They line up at the gates every morning to go to work. They're so excited. They love their jobs. They love the affection. Others say the horses may not be the problem at all. The, the carriages do seem to fit. I mean, honestly, they seem to be more of a, a fitting for that narrow street. At issue is this short stretch of Fiskard Street, the heart of Chinatown. Critics say Tuesday's freak accident only amplifies the fact that maybe those tour buses shouldn't be here. Do they fit with a, the streets so narrow that they could quite possibly go down government, drop people off, and then pick them up down on Store Street. You know, and it's a nice walk to experience the street rather than busing through. I don't think that uh, buses should be allowed in Chinatown. It's a cause that, you know, they could hit a pedestrian just as easily as nick a horse. And she says those buses are an occupational hazard horses shouldn't have to face. When it comes to the welfare of an animal, that's more important. The city says it will consider ways to make downtown safer for everyone, including those on four legs. Stephanie Sherlock, CTV News, Victoria.